today I'm going to show you what is going to be in my 19 month old girl's Easter basket. Um, I just wanted to make this video and give you some ideas if the Easter Bunny needs some help and it's always fun to see what other people come up with. This is what I came up with and I hope you guys enjoy it. I'll try and remember to tell you where I found it and if I got it online I'll leave the link down below. So the first thing is this Melissa and Doug classic owl stacker. It's wooden. It's really nice quality. She has the little like rainbow colored um like small circle one and she loves that so I think she'll have fun with this and it's 18 months up so it's perfect. Um I found this at Toys R Us so I think she'll really enjoy that. The next thing are these little do-it-yourself sponge balls and I posted a tutorial on this too. I found them on Pinterest, made them super easy. She's also going to get a splash table, so I think she'll have a lot of fun with these. The next thing, Play-Doh. Yes, I'm braving it with Play-Doh. It says three and up, but I let her play with stickers and stuff. I just, I keep it in a little bin, and anytime we want to have craft time, we pull it down. So, I'm, you know, I just, she's pretty over putting things in her mouth. So, if you think, you know... Your kid will be okay with that, then I say go for it because I think she'll have a lot of fun with it. This will be your first time playing with Play Doh, but these are little stampers. There's Bunny and a chick in each one, and they just you press it down and it has the little design. So I think she'll have fun with those. I found those at Target in the Easter section. The next thing is this personalized sing along CD. I ordered this online and it it has her name in the songs and she is obsessed with Mickey and Minnie and all that so I know she'll have fun with this and I'll I'll be sure to leave that link down below. Um next is I ordered this on Etsy. It's a little owl. It's one of those like boo-boo packs that you freeze it and then you heat it up for like if they get hurt or just if they don't feel well. Um, we don't have one of these anymore, so I just thought I'd order a cute one and stick it in her Easter basket. Like I said, I got it on Etsy, so I'll leave that link down below, too. And I got her a little crayon roll-up. Um, it's just like a little piece of fabric that has slots so you put your crayons in, and then you can roll it up, stick it in the diaper bag, um, take it, you know, stick it in their backpack for school. Um... It's a really cute print, really easy to just fold up and wrap that around. I have to get crayons to put in it, but I got that on Etsy too, so I'll leave that link down below as well. And I got her little Bubble Guppies Bubble Wand. I found this at Walmart and it was like 97 cents. So she loves bubbles and I figured the big one would be fun to play with and Bubble Guppies, she's a fan of too. These. I'm probably the most excited about, like, they look so fun. They're the Tiku, I don't know how to say it. It's a pocket pouch of blocks, and they look so fun, but they're kind of pricey, so I figured I would just get her the little pocket pouch to play with and see how she likes that. But it's awesome because you can take it on the go, and they're magnetic blocks. They're just... Take them all apart and they click together, and it just looks a lot of fun. So, she's getting those. I found these on Amazon, I think. So, I'll leave that down below. Like I said, they're, they're not cheap, but they're really good quality, and I think they'll last a long time. I got her. I used to love Paul Frank when I was, like, kid. Team. Um, so I found these alphabet flashcards and it has monkey horses, it has the letters and then the Paul Frank design of the animal. And they're really good quality too. I don't think they're wooden, but they're they're like really heavy cardboard, I guess. Like good quality, I don't know. But that's what they feel like, so I'm excited for those too. And I found these on Zoomily, but I know you can get them on Amazon too, so I'll leave that down below. The 
then I got her washable Crayola, my first washable markers. Um, she's been playing with the crayons, and I just saw these and thought, we'll get her the markers too and see how she likes those. Um, I found these at Michael's, and then you can use the 40 or 50% off coupons on them. They also have little egg crayons, which would be perfect for Easter. Then I just got her a little ABC um, Dr. Seuss book. Amazing alphabet book because I want to work on her alphabets and um, I just got that at Target. Then I I got this at the Disney store, just Little Mermaid um, fork and spoon. She just she could use some more. So you can also find any kind of characters and stuff all over pretty much like Walmart. Target has Minnie Mouse, Nikki, and boy stuff as well. These. Um, it's just a little pack of chalk. It's a four pack of chalk. This is a very, very, it's by Crayola and they're like a dollar. Just, you know, I thought it would be just a cute little thing to put in her basket. So, um, I've seen these pretty much everywhere. Target, Walmart, maybe, I think Michael's too. So I thought that's really cool. And they, they each have like, they have a whole bunch of combination packs of like ice cream, you, you know, just different colors. So that was pretty neat. And then I got these a while ago in the Target dollar section. I just figured I'd save them for her Easter basket. I got her Minnie Mouse socks and Sophie in the first. Because her feet are definitely growing and it's time for some socks. And I just got this little Minnie Mouse pinwheel to stick in here. Um, I found that at Party City, but you can find pinwheels all over, especially right now. And... Michaels always has the end cap of stickers and they're always like a dollar and then if you have coupons, you know, that helps. So I got her the owl one and Minnie Mouse Spring Sparkle Bows and Blossoms. Pretty decent sticker books for a dollar so I know she'll especially love this one. And then this I found at Target. She's obsessed with stickers. Like, I just give her that big jumbo, like, blank Crayola pad and let her stick stickers on it, and she loves it. So I found this at Target and thought she would really like that. Of course, I'll help her and do it with her, but um, it's a sticker face book, and it has just, like, blank. It has the stickers of their face and the different characters and stuff and then it has like a blank canvas to use those stickers and it looks really cute. It was kind of, I think it was like five bucks but I know she'll have fun with it and it looks pretty cute. A whole bunch of characters and different stickers so but I I did admit that's you know five bucks for them is a little much so then I found these at Walmart of course. But it's kind of the same thing. It's not nearly as big, but if you get two of them, you're still saving three bucks. So it has just the little characters again, and then the stickers, the eggs, flowers, cute little things like that. So I got her this one and that one. I think, I think they might be different. I'm not sure. But I know she'll have fun with those. And they'll last her a long time. And then I found these at, I've seen them everywhere. I, I bought these at CVS, but I've seen them at Target too. But the character little containers, um, I'm going to stick them in her basket. I'm not doing any kind of candy because I know she'll get plenty of that from grandparents, Easter egg hunts and stuff. What I'm probably going to do is we buy the Annie's brand um, cheddar bunnies. I give her those. And I've seen that they make the Graham bunnies and stuff. So I'll probably get her those as like an extra treat and put them in here. And I thought that would be cute to stick in her Easter basket as well as to keep in her diaper bag. And just hand her one to play with and eat out of and stuff. So my girl goes crazy when she sees some Minnie Mouse. She's like, Minnie, Minnie, Minnie. It's so cute. So... I just thought that would be cute to just like stick in my deck bag and pull out and give it to her and let her have a treat. 
And so that's what's in her Easter basket. And I'm pretty excited for her to get it, I will admit. I don't have it decorated yet because I still want to pick up some ribbon. I gotta get grass to decorate it, spruce it up. But in a nutshell, those are the contents. That's what she is getting in her Easter basket this year. I hope this gave you guys some ideas if you were looking. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a very happy Easter. Have a lot of fun. I'm so excited and that's it. So I'll see y'all later. Bye.